Good day, learners. Today we shall be discussing another interesting topic. That is roles of government in development of agriculture. At the end of this lesson, learners should be able to state the roles of government and agricultural development, explain agricultural policies and agricultural programs, discuss past and present agricultural programs and policies of government. What are these roles of government in agricultural development? Number one. Provision of financial assistance to farmers in the form of loans, credits, subsidies through agencies such as Nigeria Agricultural and Cooperative Bank, Agricultural Credit Guarantee Scheme, and National Directorate of Employment. Number two, provision of farm inputs like chemicals, farm tools, and implements, fertilizers, improved seeds. The improved seeds are not just provided, the government subsidizes it to enable peasant farmers to buy them with ease and make use of them. Provision of basic amenities like pipe bomb water, electricity, healthcare services to those in rural areas. Building of dams to overcome problems of unpredictable weather so that farmers can farm at any time of the year. Provision of storage and processing facilities in order to prevent food wastage and provide food in periods of scarcity. Government also, through its agency like the Directorate of Food, Road and Rural Infrastructures, has helped to construct roads in rural areas for effective transportation network. This will enable the farmers to connect to markets that are located in the town or cities. Provision of pest and disease control services by the government. Government has helped to employ qualified and experienced extension officers to provide extension services to rural farmers. And government has also helped in provision of agricultural education to help majority, which will help majority of the farmers who are illiterate. This will help to enlighten them. The government set up research institutes to provide solutions to problems of local crops and animals with a view to increasing production. Examples of agricultural research institutes are National Cereal Research Institute in Patege, Koko Research Institute of Nigeria in Ibadan, Nigeria Institute for Oil Palm Research in Benin, National Institute for Trepanosomiasis Research, National Horticultural Research Institute in Ibadan, Robert Research Institute of Nigeria in Benin, the National Root and Crop Research Institute in Omodike, Forestry Research Institute of Nigeria in Ibadan, the National Veterinary Research Institute in Bom, Plateau State. Government also has established agricultural program with the aim of boosting greater production of crops and livestock. Such programs include Agricultural Loan Scheme, River Basin Development Authority, National Agricultural Insurance Scheme, Green Revolution, Operation Feed the Nation, National Agricultural Land Development Agency, Agricultural Development Projects, Director of Food, Road and Rural Infrastructure, National Accelerated Industrial Crop Production Program, National Accelerated Food Production Program, Agro Service Centers, 
farm settlement scheme cooperative farming now some of these established programs by the government will look at some of them one by one major objectives of the agricultural development programs farm settlement scheme this was established in 1959 by then western region government of nigeria the aims were to reduce the rate of unemployment among young school leavers to make farming attractive to the youth to teach settlers modern farming practices to develop rural infrastructure including shelter thus making the rural areas more attractive to reduce rural urban migration to improve yields and harvest of the settlers thus contributing to gross domestic product to improve the efficiency of extension agents due to concentration of efforts and facilities to extend its multiplier efforts to the surrounding farmers who may visit the settlers of the scheme to learn new techniques of farming to solve the problem of land tenure agro service centers what are the aims to supply drugs and vaccine to farmers to provide expert services to farmers to provide farm inputs like seeds and fertilizer and reduce rates to supply spare parts for agricultural machine and implements river basin authorities river basin authorities was set up between 1979 and 1983 the aims were to provide irrigation and drainage facilities through construction of dams and drainage channels all year round for agriculture production to assist in bringing more land under cultivation to increase total output per farmer with increased net revenue returns to construct feeder roads for project sites and ensure good transportation to improve rural infrastructure generally thus reducing rural urban migration to help in construction of fish ponds and enhance distribution of fingerlings to farmers agricultural development projects it started in 1975 and co-financed by the world bank federal and state governments the aim is to boost agricultural production through construction of farm service centers for efficient distribution of agricultural inputs to help in construction of rural infrastructure such as feeder roads and earth dams to increase level of extension contact with the farmers to bring agricultural services closer to the people in the rural areas to source for and make farm inputs available to farmers to help in the reclamation of degraded agricultural lands. Green Revolution. It was set up in 1975 and 1983 by the federal government. One of the aim is to encourage large scale farming, to establish river basin authorities to boost the supply of water for irrigation purposes, to produce abundant food for local consumption to produce cash crops for export purposes. Operation Feed the Nation Operation Feed the Nation was set up by the retired General Olisegun Obasanjo during the military regime between 1976 and 1979. Purpose is to increase food production, to popularize agriculture, to provide food for all Nigerians, to facilitate agricultural development in all parts of Nigeria. Director of Food, Roads and Rural Infrastructure This was established in 1986 by the federal government. 
The aims were to provide rural infrastructure that would facilitate food production and processing, to develop small scale agro based industries, to provide electricity to rural dwellers, to provide rural infrastructure that would improve the quality of life for rural dwellers. Cooperative farming. Cooperative farming is a kind of farming initiated by the government in which a group of farmers come together for farming purposes. Corporate farming plays numerous roles in the development of agriculture. These roles are provision of farm inputs for the members of the cooperative, provision of processing facilities for their members, storage, provision of storage facilities for the members, provision of ready market for farm produce, provision of funds or capital for their members, creating awareness among members on what and when and how to produce. Encourages large scale production and expansion of members' investment frontiers. Revision questions State four rules of government in agricultural production. 2a. List six agricultural programs introduced by the government of Nigeria. 2b. State the major objectives of each of any five of the agriculture program listed above in 2a number three list eight agricultural research institutes in nigeria number four discuss briefly four ways in which any of the following has contributed to agricultural development in nigeria number one agricultural development projects number two farm settlement scheme number c cooperative farming then number four river basin and rural development authorities if you find it difficult to go through this question go over the video again i believe by doing so you will be able to do much more thank you for being on this platform today have a great day